All right, we're excited to have Bishop Larry D. Trotter, mm-hmm. Larry Donnell, right? That's it. Larry Donnell Trotter. <laughs> Where did Donnell come from? Uh, that was a blues singer. My mother told me Larry Donnell. I don't know, but oh, a lot wow. of people back in the day were named Larry Donnell. So they put two together. Wow. <laughs> well, you um, wanted to come on today because you wanted the city to pray for you. You know, I wanted to clear up. I didn't want people to, uh, the news went out kind of the wrong way. Mm-hmm. I don't want people to think I'm dying because I believe that uh, I'm going to live and not die. Okay. Amen. And that uh, the cancer is uh, in the primary stages and that we can we can beat this. All right. Mm-hmm. So what the, you went to the doctor. Give us, uh, tell us what happened. I went to the doctor. For, I had been going for regular checkups. uh Last year, and PSA was high, which is something that uh, African American men have to check, mm-hmm. and uh, uh, the insurance had required me to go to get a um, ultrasound of the okay. prostate. Uh, the doctor recommended I have a biopsy, and it, and it came back um, that I had cancer. Told me in March. Okay. So I had the family come in uh, to, to weigh out the the options, the plan, uh, and uh, the best plan is for me to have surgery. And uh, to get it removed before it spreads. Okay. And I didn't want people to think that it had spread it because it went out as breaking news. And and um, I just believe God. He's healed me so many other times. Is this your yeah. first rush with cancer? Yes. Or this is. Mm-hmm. So that clears up a lot, too. Yeah. Because at one point there was something that said that you had, that you were uh, suffering with cancer. No. So that I, was not true. No, I didn't have cancer. I had a lot of other illnesses, mm-hmm. and uh, mm-hmm. they did have to take pathology reports because they thought it was cancer. Mm-hmm. So are they saying that they caught it at an early stage for you? Yes. They say it's at an early stage, and uh, I should be well. I'll be down maybe four or five weeks and then uh, uh, back up if, if there's no complications. I, I won't have to have radiation or chemo. How okay. are you feeling, Bishop? Oh, I feel fine. The doctor said to you me, look said, great. Doctor said to mm-hmm. me, he said, well, you know, uh, with your blood work and everything, we thought you would be fainting or tired. I said, man, I preached three services and dance. He said, well, <laughs> what do you mean by dance? I said, I have to bring your tape, please. <laughs> <laughs> now, I was surprised that you went public with this. Why did you decide to go public with it? After conversation with the uh, with the cardinal mm-hmm. and uh, uh, others, when you're a public figure, you mm-hmm. know these these organizations start calling you and saying, you know, um, we're hearing this, we're hearing that, and so we wanted to make sure that it was cleared up. I mean, I had people calling me from California. Uh, one lady announced in the pulpit, Bishop Trot only had 90 days to live. Oh my gosh! That That's why I would go public. What? Yeah. These people are crazy. Oh yeah, and all this happened long before I went public, so I mm-hmm. said I needed mm-hmm. to clear it up, let people know that that those rumors are not true you know i'm not on chemo i'm not dying Uh, i'm going to have this procedure may the 22nd the surgery may 22nd i should only be in the hospital for a couple of days and then go into the um um the treatment so what Mm -hmm. advice do you give to men because we always hear that black men need to be extremely careful and then at the age of 40 that black men need to go get their yearly checkups yeah. after 40 and definitely do the prostate exam. What do you say? I, I, I think they should. And I, 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 this uh, certainly uh, makes me want to encourage more. You know, it's not the, not the nicest test. It's one right. of the most humiliating tests. But early detection can can cause people to live uh, so much longer. A young man called me on yesterday at our church, uh, and he's 75. He said he had uh, prostate cancer at, at 55. And he's fine. He looks like he's 60. But on the other end, there are others who go undetected. Mm-hmm. And by the time it's detected, it is already spread and uncontrollable. So had you been get, doing your annual checkup since the age of 40? Not annually, but okay. I've had, I'm had them pretty regularly. Okay. And uh, I'm glad that I did because I, I intend to live a long time. And had I, not, had I not, we could be having a, another conversation today. Right. Well, we um, want you to know that we're going to definitely be covering you in prayer. Absolutely. In Chicago, we ask that you please remember Bishop Larry Donnell Trotter in mm-hmm. our prayers. And we we believe that by his stripes that we are healed. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. So this is, I always say to us, this is a time now that we have to now stand on everything that we've been preaching. That's right. You know, <laughs> and I, I, I don't believe God's going to leave me out there. I've been preaching this book. Well, you know, we all raised together here. Mm-hmm. I've been preaching for 36 years and pastoring now 31 years. And I've seen him do so many other things. Right. I, I just believe it's another test. And uh, but I got to stand on that. You know, when you start talking that C word, you get a little shaky. 
Uh, but um, I know by his stripes, I'm healed. Amen. All right. All is we're well. We're standing with you. Well, we're Amen. standing with you. All right, Chicago. Remember, Bishop Trotter, in your prayers, this is National Prayer Day. And you're having a service today, right? Uh, yeah, I'm speaking in one of the national prayer services at the Oakland Hilton at uh, 930 today. They're going to have different speakers praying. I'm praying for the youth and children of Good. the city. I just wanted to explain that because you got your little preaching gear on. <laughs> I don't want nobody to watch the video and see, think that you get up and dress like this every day. <laughs> Well, I'm, I'm, well, I'm coming bishop. down here because y- y'all wouldn't let me tell my, my uh, uh, I remember when story. So I didn't no. do. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's remember Bishop Trotter in our prayers. Thank you so much. God bless you. Bless you. It's the John Hanna Morning Show. Hey, this is your main 